Hi everyone, this is James from This End Up. I'm going to be uh, showing you, this is part of our uh, PlayStation 3 um, legacy, the best of I should say, of um, PlayStation 3, and I'm going to be showing you all Infamous. Uh, Infamous is a Sucker Punch game, uh, developed by Sucker Punch. It's a kind of a sandbox slash open world um, action um, and slash comic book type uh, game type. So um, you run, you 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 get your missions. You do run and gun, and you have uh, special powers. Comic, you know, like a comic book character, you have uh, special unique powers. Um, to me, I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, I beat the game already, uh, but I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, just show you. This is post beating the game, so there's no storyline, so this won't be any spoilers or anything. So I'm just going to show you some of the game mechanics. If you notice, you can run around. You can't, you can't drive, even though there is vehicles around, but it's just they're mainly used to um, be, be, you know, a little bit of an inconvenience, I would say, and. Um, And to just you know go ahead and give you certain powers, that's just me regaining my health. Um, the character he he kind of he to get regenerative powers he has to use electricity to get his uh, powers back. So I have guys shooting at me right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and kill them. Um, and I'm going to and it, it's like kind of like a, a little bit. I mean, I could say I could say Assassin's Creed, but it's much faster, fluid. Uh, the the wall, if you notice, the wall jumping and climbing is much more fluid than Assassin's Creed, I think. So um, it's more stylized, kind of like uh, street, you know, kind of like uh, parkour and stuff like that. And I just kicked that guy's butt. Um, and he threw a grenade. So I'm gonna go ahead and regenerate my health. Uh, if I double click on the on my um, and, oh I got a trophy, sweet. If I double click on the analog sticks that tells me where my power sources are, so I can go ahead and uh, regenerate. And uh, these guys are still after me, so I'm going to try to find them. I have my mini map on the on the bottom right. It's a decent map. It tells you where your points are. You need to go. Um, since I beat the game, I you know. Mission-wise, I'm, I'm just—I could just do all my sub-missions that I missed or didn't, didn't take care of. Right, these guys are probably down here somewhere. I'm trying to find out where they are. Right, overall, I mean, the game runs really good. Uh, I would say the PS3. Uh, this came out a couple of years back. Um, I'm gonna say 09. Could be wrong. I don't know. Can't remember. Could be uh, 2010. But um. Part 2 came out last year, I'm trying to remember, and then that came out two years ago, so that would be uh, 2010, I believe. That could be wrong. So this guy, these guys are after me. I'm going to go ahead and throw some of my fireballs at them. You have special unique abilities. That's my grenade electric abilities. They just fly all over the place. And, uh, which to me is similar to, uh, you know, I would say Saints Row in a way, but it's it's more you know more to be more action type oriented. You need to kick people, and so you know he's dead. The villains are really good in this game. They do a good job with the villains. Um, the AI is superb. I can't um, compliment the, the development team on that. When you're when you're trying to escape or you know trying to, to fight these guys, they, they they run around you. They'll they'll avoid you or use their abilities to to, to knock you out. So um, you just gotta try to try to out out you know outpace them or outbeat them. And you do have a pretty good arsenal here of powers. I'll go into that menu in a moment here. I'm gonna kill this guy wherever he is. I think he's on top. Pretty sure he's on top. They usually hang out on the top. Most of the villains do. To get the advantage. Let's see. Yeah, they're over 
this way. So yeah. That's my sniper. Slow down. Does a slow down and then you can kill him. I like I prefer that power if I can. Standard electric. Just gives him a good shock. Doesn't do too much damage to him, but you can do a shield here. Trying to get those guys there. Alright, all right, that's it. Alright, no more funny games. Before I die again, which I know entertains people when I do die. Alright, there we go. There it is. I was looking for the shield. Hey, bear with me, it's been a while since I played this game. But yeah, you can shield. This shield's pretty handy when, you when it comes to getting the villains. I mean, the melee is really good, too. I mean, he's very fluid. I mean, he'll just knock him out. Get some power here. And then my meter on the top left is, it says hero, so I'm, I'm taking the good route. Um, you get different abilities. I'm gonna go through that right now, actually. And then you get those submissions. Alright, let's go to the powers here. Alright. So, for being good, you get certain powers. For being evil, um, it gives you it gives you different different skill types. So, um, I've taken the good route. So, I've gotten the shockwave, the lightning bolt, which y'all have seen. And uh, if you notice with evil, I think uh, you'll you'll shoot red instead of blue. So, I haven't done evil. Maybe my next game, when I play it again, I'm I'll be evil. And then overlord overlord burst. And then you know with evil. Um, you get you get that move. So I don't have that move. Um, so you would have to go ahead and choose to be evil to get that 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 type skill type. So shot grenade, which I've showed, uh, it's a good move. And the hammer is uh, is a pretty good one as well. Thunder drop, I've done a couple of times. That's a pretty cool move. Um, definitely gives you space when it comes to the villains because the villains can be pretty tough in the game uh, for the most part uh, they you will occasion you will find yourself dying a lot but it's it's good because um, you know it gives it that challenge even though you have all these powers so it, it balances out and it makes you have to kind of you know really be smart instead of just doing a run and gun type where oh I'm, I'm, I'm invincible and I don't have to worry about dying so uh, they give you consequences so, uh, reduce damage, melee, electric drain, which that gives you your, um, your powers back. And then, uh, you know, your shield. So these are, these are your, some of your powers you can get in the game, which is pretty cool. And, uh, I, I, that's what the most part I enjoy about the game, so. Um, precision, lightning storms, that's a cool one too. That's a pretty awesome one, actually. So, uh, there's, uh, yeah, there's different, there's different types, so. And then, you know, I beat the game already, but these are your mini quests, so you can go ahead and, uh, you know, start it. I'll just start it real quick, just to show. We rigged up another bus, and we need you to escort it to the hospital. These are random, random, I think some of them are random to do, you know, you can just do these little mini quests. So, um, I'm just going to follow him, so that's what my mini-map tells me to do. But yeah, if you notice, it's, it's, the storyline is, is, you know, he gets these powers and, you know, you're, you're in a city, and, um, you're trying you're trying to pretty much escape town and and you know to avoid all the you know villains and and uh, criminals from uh, 
from from killing you, of course. So I mean, and he gets in, you know, the character gets into this big plot of uh, trying to uh, protect himself and his friends, and it, it gets it's it gets, it's actually got a really good storyline. So I'm pretty happy about it. And uh, I'm gonna escort this bus, so these villains are gonna start popping me. And I freaking almost killed myself doing it in the process. But yeah, this is uh. Yeah, this is pretty good. This is one of the escort missions you do in the, towards the end of the game. This is like a bonus. So, um. It's pretty cool. I, uh. Yeah, I enjoyed I enjoyed this mission type. This is a lot of guys in this one. Wow. I'm just gonna check my grenades at them. That's pretty much like I prefer the grenades. Just stick with the grenades. And just you know, destroy whoever's in your way anyways. So yeah, that's that's pretty much the logist logist of it. That was cool. Yeah, got him pretty good there. And um, yeah, this is infamous, so I mean, it's definitely a pretty good game. Uh, it was I got it for free when PlayStation had their uh, online issue a while back. So um, I just wanted to kind of oh man, they got a big guy coming in. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to give you all a showing of infamous. Um, definitely, I would say one of the better exclusives that uh, PS, PS3 had, one of their shining stars, and uh, I I definitely recommend checking it out if you have a PS3 or wanting to play it. So there you go, and I died. So it's a good way to end it, end this video. So all right, thanks for watching, and um, we'll be I'll be posting a couple more videos soon, and uh, just, just check it out. All right, thank y'all.